Hello there, this is Aircar95 right here bringing you some Doom multiplayer close beta gameplay for you guys to enjoy. I managed to get my hands on this Doom gameplay due to the fact that I just pre ordered it from Amazon and they gave me a code and I put the code on my PlayStation and boom, it was just simple as that. And yeah, <laughs> it's quite an easy thing to do. I kind of want to thank you guys on my, my last video support. You know, that was quite an awkward topic to talk about, but I got some nice feedback off that, which is very appreciated. Thank you very much, guys. But then, enough about the last video. Let's talk about the Doom. What is my impressions of Doom? Let's go over it, shall we? Let's start with the gamers. The gamers on this game are pretty good. Uh, team Deathmatch is your standard TDM. Uh, I saw the other t uh, gamers. There's some new ones in there that I want to try out when the uh, full game does come out. I will be playing this game as well. Hopefully, uh, it's got co-op campaign. I don't think it does, but uh, it would be nice if it did. Um, anyway, enough of that. Uh, the, the other gamers, Warpath, the, which I'm playing now, is pretty much a hard point, but it moves around the map. And then you see there's the arrows on which the path will go in for the uh, where the war path will be going and you pretty much just got to follow it and stay captured on it you know you know normal standard hard point stuff which is very nice and interesting to do um the blood and gore in this game are fucking incredible like it's ridiculous how brutal this game can be which is good because it's actually sticking to its doom color of goriness of back in the past on the ps2 and ps1 days where it was at and when you come in, when you uh, nice someone very low on health, the um, you do a glory kill, and a glory kill, what it is, is pretty much you knife them. Well, it's pretty much a knife thing, and you um, pretty much do rip, either rip off the head or break their necks, like rip their arms off or something like that. It's very satisfying to see. It. As you see there, I just die by suicide because I couldn't jump for shit. So that's great, isn't it? Just suicide in the video for like that. <laughs> Uh, when you come with demons as well, the demons are so good in this game, it's fucking fun. Like, you're gonna be there in fucking like a minute, you're gonna see me like once or twice, I think, in this game, uh, being a demon, and it's really satisfying because you're gonna be a different demon on each map, which is really cool, and different demons have different abilities, so different, um, glory kills for each one of them. As you see, I kill a demon myself, and actually come a demon as it is, as you see, you get seen in there. And like I said, it's very satisfying, and especially when you get like three people like that. It is so much fun, and I, it's just it was great just being a demon. Um, what else is there? The guns. The guns are very good. Like there's no OP gun. Like every gun I think is quite balanced on this game, which is very nice. I'm hoping they have more variants of the guns in the game. Um, like with the rocket launchers, more than one rocket launcher, or light uh, lightning gun or shotguns. There's more than one of each. Otherwise, that will come very stale real quick, which would be quite disappointing to see. But um, that's that part done, covered. Uh, what else is there? There is the health packs and the shield. Uh, when you you only can actually collect these around the map to actually recover your health and shield. Same with ammo as well. And you see, I got glory kill. I got my head busted in. That was quite gruesome. But um. Yeah, you only can collect like health and ammo packs around the map. You can't reload your gun either. It's pretty much all just shoot and blazing. And so that's quite an interesting feature to see. Because I keep pressing square sometimes, which is quite annoying. Because I was trying not to do it. But I kept doing it. And I realized, oh yeah, you have to get ammo around the whole map. So it's quite interesting to do that. Um, the maps on this game are pretty nice. They're quite a nice flow over to it. There's no shoot. No, it's not really long. Uh, sometimes you can get quite lost as well if you're not near the objective. Um, some people won't be there, it'll be quite hard to find them, which is quite annoying, but anyway, that's how it is. Um, I'm hoping that will be like some a bonus thing if you're on like a 30 kill streak, because I saw it in the medals. I was looking at the medals because I think I went on a 10 kill streak, I'm pretty sure. And pre and on a 30 kill streak, I wonder if they do something like because you know. You, Call of Duty and stuff, they did like a nuke or something. So I'm hoping like if you get a fair kill streak, you come like a super badass with a rocket, like a mega gun, and you just shit on people like no tomorrow, like you kill them, or you become like a really powerful demon, something like that, you last about a minute. And that'd be quite awesome to see, to see if that happens in this game. I doubt it will happen, but it'd be quite nice to see if anything does happen about a fair kill streak idea. Um, as you see that, I punched him off the fucking map. <laughs> it was quite a good fun this game was. Um, I'm hoping the story as well on this game is not going to be too stale. I'm hoping it's going to be a really good story. Because, to be honest, in the multiplayer wise, you know, it was good. But I, I'm hoping that it's not all focused on multiplayer, if that makes sense. I'm hoping the story is really good. Because that what made Doom popular was its storyline. And it was a very good bl bloody game. Mm -hmm. And so I'm just hoping the multiplayer and the story, if it's combined together, I can see Doom being very successful. And if they do bring any DLC out, I'm hoping to add more demons and more variety of guns oh, into the game. 
And to kill a demon's well in this game, if you just do not know, is fucking very hard. Like, he does not die quick, so you have to, like, have him distracted and just hopefully just kill him as well. And he come and fucked him in the ass. But anyway, this has been the boy of Kalan 5 right here. Really hope you enjoy this Doom gameplay. My impression of Doom is a very solid game so far, model player wise. Um, hopefully, more variety of guns will come into play. Oh, yeah, I forgot to say actually, the mods on this game that you get, uh, there's quite different types of mods you do have. And. Well, you can use these type of mods to actually improve the character, so you get more XP in the match, or you can find more power-ups easily on the map, or you find where the demon will spawn on the map. You know, it will tell you when you spawn in, pretty much, you can select a mod. Every time you die, you can select a new mod, but you will run out of that mod soon, so you have to select new ones as soon as you run out at the end of the match. But yeah, there's quite interesting what mods can do, and hopefully there's more, see what different types they're bringing. But, um... Anyway, this is it. again. Sorry about that. I forgot about the mods. But this has been the video kind of right here. Hope you do enjoy Doom. Like I said, Doom is a solid game. Hopefully, more variety. Like I said, uh, at the moment it is looking promising. Let's say that. Anyway, guys, this has been the video kind of five. Like I said, take care and talk to you later. Bye.